What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here. We're playing some RimWorld. This is the Mechanator. Me Mechanator. I guess I'll just go with that for good um, playthrough. Our pollution level is spreading. I've left the pollution overlay on just so I can keep an eye on it. Doesn't... I mean, we could keep cleaning up this area and then <laughs> dumping it back over here. I, in retrospect, wish I had put it further away, but it's 59 waste packs currently. So, whatever. The goal here is to get to this. And I'm... What is this indicating? We meet, we need something. Requires a study of nano structuring chip. You gotta be shitting me, where is that? All right, so we're not keeping up with plants either. I think what I'm gonna do is have this guy grow just to catch everything up. We've had a lot of the plants die off. Now, where do I find nano structuring chip? Nano, is that even here? No, that's really frustrating. Okay, so it looks like the chip is something we have to acquire and study. So we really can't do squat about the pollution <laughs> until we get that done. Uh, also, the mechs can be mostly unrestricted. Okay, that should keep them busy. We're still chopping trees, which we could probably put an end to that, but whatever. Needs are pretty decent. We did send somebody packing, but I guess that was long enough away that it doesn't matter anymore. Okay, so yeah, I guess we're just going to chill and do research and see what we can get accomplished here. We don't really have a good stockpile of steel around. I was debating on having the constructor wall this in and then we can mine through here, but that does leave potential insect infestation available to our home zone and I don't really like the idea of that so okay so anyways uh, these must not be ready okay good so I think we're cool for the moment uh, batteries are not holding so maybe we go for geothermal and what do we have for blocks we might be able to get that thing enclosed I can also move walls around so not the end of the world. Probably we should at least prep for where this is going to go. And it needs six on center, so you need to make sure you leave a little bit of space. Like that. That's too many. There we go. And we can actually just cancel these ones for the moment. Because we can shift these walls over. I don't know that we're going to have enough block available, but that is what it is. Let's alter this. The hall dude will take care of getting the right blocks put here for us, and then we don't have to worry about it. So this will be just granite. Hopefully there's space over here to take those two and replace them. There you go. He's on top of it. These robots are so efficient. And we're cruising on 4x speed. Our clean sweeper has not a damn thing to do most of the time. <laughs> Pops up once in a while. The addition of the mod that makes those dudes smarter has been pretty phenomenal. I think I'll put a door in over here too. Just because you never know where you're going to end up and how. Okay, we have overflowed. Okay, there's... Ugh, room left to put three more so let's just shift this wall back and do that and then we'll solar flare hopefully our food doesn't spoil we do have some meat hanging about uh, it's getting kind of warm outside too I probably have to put an air conditioning unit in this area here at 4x speed everything goes so fast it's fantastic these robots generally seem really slow but in this situation, they're kicking ass, so. Well, we did get rid of the fibrous mechanites. They're still suffering from sensory mechanites. And he's also helping that dude. So it turns out one of these guys isn't really sufficient to keep up on this. I'm hoping we can net some real money from these things. I'm 
somewhat intrigued to paint, but I don't know that it really makes any difference or gives you any benefit. All right, good. So this is ready to go. And that's good because we're once again, oh, some of them deteriorated away. So when they deteriorate away, that's when the zone expands out. I think we've run out of block as well. What is this bro doing researching? So I need to kick this on. There we go. It should get it done. Might have to force it. No, there we go. Perfect. All right. So we don't have any more granite blocks over here. That's the next problem. So let's just set some of the or chunks, I should say. Let's just set some of those to be hauled over. And we'll just make them as we need to. And how'd our Neanderthal buddy do? I believe it was that dude. No, it was this dude because he took a lot of effort to get rid of. All right, rice is rotting away in storage, which I guess is okay. We overproduced rice for a long time early on. All right, how are we doing here? Bills. All right, that should be sufficient. I'm a little hesitant to leave our zone open here. Can also like start doing this tedium. Again, if they don't bust it all out right away. Oh, that was the game hiccuped and uh, don't know what to say about that. All right, we do have a volcanic winter that just started. So that's interesting. On 4x speed, everybody cruises so fast. All right, now we can build a copy to flush the rest of that out. There you go. That's not really going to affect us. I don't think it might slow the plant growth because we don't have as much sunlight, but I think that's just fine. All right, so we are prepped for... Well, we got two left, three total, there you go. Um, did he just, okay, no, we finished the job, good. All right, so we have enough blocks to finish that at least, and there's some extra floating about. Visitors with stuff to trade. Don't go through the poison, friends. Let's see, did that even affect you? No, it did not. And we're gonna go trade with Faye. I mean, I think I'm going to turn it down a little bit. Heavy SMG. Let's sell these clothes. We took off that, dude. We're not going to need those. They have some meds. Probably good to stockpile some of that. They don't, of course, buy most of the crap we would like to sell. So there you go. I'm going to force this dude to haul this stuff in. Yeah, I think if I could add another mod, it would be the Haul Plus mod. It's more sensible hauling is definitely in order. Oh yeah, I was going to slow it down a little bit. We're just going way too fast here. The visitors have seen and had enough. This bedroom is slightly impressive. This room is at 70, so I think volcanic winter is helping us a bit in terms of the temperature. I'm going to remove growing as well. I think we're just fine in that regard. Okay, cool, man. Fast progress. Although lots of time has passed, <laughs> not a lot is really going on here. Where's our little safety bro? Lifter, there he is. Patrolling, assign to group, auto repair, select to overseer. So I can't like tell that dude to shut down and not do squat. One thing that might make the most sense is to keep him in the compound. I guess he's just gonna keep doing that. He says he has something similar to a shotgun. It's pretty interesting that we can just make those dudes. <laughs> so, question becomes, where can I acquire a nano chip for fuckagery? What was it called? A nano structuring chip. That's the only thing that... Oh, no, there are other things. Power focus. Okay. Oh, no. So the nano structuring chip does get us a few things. It's a signal chip. Okay, great. So we're going to have to find a bunch of these chips. I'm assuming those come through via quests or something. Hey, check it out. They're all just chilling. That's good because... Ooh, a nice psychic soothe. Did we... Oh, that just got poisoned under the wall. That's okay. Maybe when it starts creeping out here, we start cleaning it. I'm not even concerned. I don't... We have space to expand, but we really don't need much more space in this instance. <clears throat> I'm a little... God damn that thing. I'm a little worried about... 
long term like are we gonna be able to power all these mechs and are we gonna be able to so there's one there one there and there's one down there yes we're gonna have to I'm, I don't know about things like scythers and centipedes and so I, can, I think the point though is to build up a massive army and then start summoning threats cannot summon war queen no mech band antenna cannot summon Apocriton threat. Okay, so I think security is going to be tantamount. But a Diabolus threat is ready to summon. Is that the same thing we can summon here? Yes, indeed. Okay. Interesting. Okay, so you get the chips by incrementally summoning and destroying these mechs. Three liter mechanoid types each summoned a different way each dropping a different type of chip so there you go so at least we i thought maybe that was quest based and it's i guess it sort of is but hopefully it doesn't show up and kick our ass so i think preparation then is going to be key because what we cannot do is make any larger mechs we can't even do this dude so we can't get to a point where we can atomize waste packs till we've defeated the final mech bro that's pretty shitty. Death rest. Okay, these are things for the vampire equivalent, I think. Check out his mood, man. Super green. He is still sick and in serious pain, but despite that, having that really nice chair there helps too. He's luxuriantly comfortable. Debating on... Oh, he got rid of both the diseases. All right, there's the benefit of 4x speed, so he shouldn't have sick anymore. No, he's doing fantastic. I've never had a pawn, so... So happy. That's, that's great. Okay, so what's the next play, I guess? There are additional things we could take apart on the map. We don't really need those resources. I need a mining robot. So what can I do to make that? I believe... Standard mech tech. Probably a tunneler is our guy. Yeah. Interesting. And we're going to need an array headset for sure if we're going to try and do this with one dude. So we can't really make a mech army without being able to control a sufficient number of mechs. And we need to keep these little guys going because they're doing all the basic odds and ends around here that we don't really want to be doing. I'm going to keep turning this down. I'm not even sure if it's possible to do this with one guy, but they seem to set up the scenario because uh, to make it that way because everybody's a recluse. So, I mean, with this level of happiness, it doesn't much matter. At some point, perhaps we can prep to take another person on. I'm still torn on the trap corridor as well. I think that level of security would be nice. And I guess we'll see. As soon as the threat looks like it actually has a chance of doing a sin, we'll, uh, we'll get to that point. So maybe some more blocks are in order, but we do have enough limestone that we can add a second wall. Still short on steel. That's going to be a problem. This, oh, he did have a psychic suit going, so that explains to some degree the extreme happiness. Yeah, it did drop down a bit. We still haven't gotten anywhere in the cooking ability. It'd be nice if we could make fine meals. At this point, we don't yet need them. I could just have them cook a shit ton of meals. We do have the material for that. But again, everything's going real smooth. So while he's researching, he's happier than could be. I don't know how. I thought it said there were, oops, three of these guys per group. <clears throat> but now that is not the case. I would like to put the military dudes... Oh, look at that. You can set them to dormant. Mm, that might be something that mod's adding. But it also might just be something that was built in. So now I've lost track of what's actually built into the game versus what the mods are adding. But that's fine. At least they're doing something that seems more sensible than just burning energy all the time. So assign to group two, and then we got this little bro, so if I'm going to assign to group one. 
There we go. So a work group and a military group. That seems to make sense for whatever it's worth. Oh, uh, hold on a minute, then. So we can do like this. Oh, okay, cool. That's what that is. You tell them how much power you want them to maintain. That's good news. And then this dude can just go dormant. And then when it's time to wake up, we wake his ass up. That's exactly what we needed before. So we probably built up like a handful of these that we didn't need to build up because we had this dude active when he shouldn't have been. And that's, ah, oh geez. I'm half tempted a geologist. All right, it's a chick. 27, he's 18. That's a little old, but maybe he's got some things to learn. She mines, and that's what we need. A fast-walking ascetic. All right, let's, uh, let's plan a little expansion. I mean, we have the the means here there's no great spot to do it but orders mine i don't want to expose any overhead mountain but so her job is going to be mining please tell me she cooks she does not cook that does mean we need to increase the number of meals we have so we have two people so we want to shoot for seven oh no do until you have okay this was the wrong job <laughs> three uh, this might really upset him because we have been getting a nice boost to seven and three. We've been getting a nice boost for being alone. Holy shit. All right, this will be the Mechanator home base, and this will be the laboratory site. As if there were going to be other sites, but whatevs. So beds. What do we make that one out of? A wood. Let's do a bed for her, and then we'll get her set up in our own bedroom once we get this mined out and she kicks ass at the mining she does have a nice weapon now even though she's not very adept in its use that turned out good a war merchant has shown up that's fantastic who's better at social type stuff or well he sucks she's a three all right, we're going to actually use her for the talking for whatever it's worth. Okay, good. She has no health issues. Let's also make sure we're not going to find any overhead mountain here. All right, so his job can then be to not mine. Like, if you're really bored, that's cool, but... All right, let's go trade with these boners. Uh, we have an auto pistol. I should smelt it, but we're gonna, now that we have a miner, I think we'll be in good shape. They have... This is a tribal tribal dudes it's disappointing we don't want any critters we don't want any food just a little bit of money it's fine let's uh all right cool man so i'm gonna bite the bullet on the expansion i i think it's i think it's gonna be necessary long term and watch this needs recluse in a small group so still get a bonus Does she have any kind of like, oh, she's ascetic. That's fantastic. I missed that too. So he's just recluse. So, okay, sweet. All right, we're going to need more steel as well. So I think we'll go ahead and do some chop or some mining down here. Thus far, I've been manually doing it. But now that we have somebody really good, I might uh, just go. Ooh, yeah, okay, we'll just gather that for now. And they'll move her bed in. She'll be fine. He's still somewhat happy. Uh, bed is no longer assigned to Morris, but it actually is. And this will definitely solve our still problem. So we can kind of go around and gather up all the resources on the map. As we need them, I don't want to go too over the top and raise our value very dramatically. I think that would be a bad play. We are going to need components. There's 36 of those on the map. That's good. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch over here, too. So I'm going to tell her to mine these, but otherwise we'll chill out on that for the most part. How's the power doing? The power is doing fine, too. So she wants an awful bedroom. So this is not in our cleaning zone, and we'll leave it out of our cleaning zone. Uh, this is a spot for a cool... 
Ah, shit, it's gonna have to be reinstalled, but it's a spot for a cooler. <laughs> if I could get her set up as a Militor, we did have a quest at one point to make that happen. No, no. Eddie, that, oh, here we go. Uh, collect his corpse. So then we have to, like, start taming animals. And are these guys, can these be used as pack animals? I guess it would make sense if they could, right? Pack. <laughs> yes. Now how the fuck are we going to feed these bros? So this is the next question. Female, male, female. Where's he at? There he is. Male. Do they have any injuries? No, we'll tame that dude and that chick, and we'll be good. We just need to keep them away from our plants. We might have to fence in an area for those dudes, too, which is non ideal, or else they may wander off. I guess we'll just see what happens. All right, it's been tamed. Now, it doesn't. It says it'll maintain a zone, so clearly I need to alter the configuration on these. I'm going to leave them unrestricted. If they eat some of these plants, I don't really give a shit. I could put some sleeping spots in here just to keep them safe at night for the most part. But otherwise, I'm not terribly concerned. I'm somewhat intrigued to see if these two decide to reproduce. That would suck because an ascetic and a non-ascetic. She should be happy about her bedroom situation. Yeah. Let's keep that place filthy. All right, yeah, this needs to be reinstalled. <laughs> I swear I did it right. And then uh, I botched it. There we go. Okay, so that'll do the job. All right, so she should be set. Could have made it a little smaller, but that's okay. I was trying to... Make sure I can leverage the power over here. I guess it doesn't matter in this game if it's through a stone wall. But well, Please leave a like if you're enjoying. Leave a comment. I do read them all. I do respond. I appreciate you guys being with me today. Next time we will uh, carry on. I do need to see about getting her to be a mech. No shitballs. Alright, so mechs inside. Animals in inside. These dicks are going to prepare for a while. Looks like there's at least three of them. Uh, and then this dude, activate. Set him on escort. Let's go see what we're going to deal with. Okay, three. They all have melee weapons. That's a good sign. We'll deal with these guys next time. Thanks again. I love you all. I'll see ya.